This is what, what we call our annual stock assessment, where we come out on the Oregon Clatsop beaches and we assess the razor clam population. We basically have a pump out system where we use a, a pump to bring water into uh, a wand that we insert into a, a basket, a, a bottomless basket that's a half square meter. Razor clams are neutrally buoyant, they float to the surface. We enumerate them, take size, release them. And this is how we kind of get an idea of what our population is on our beach. But it also, we can kind of determine what our size range is. If we have, um, you know, how many juveniles to how many mature clams. And we can break that out. We kind of get a strength, or understand the strength of our set. And the set is the new clams that have just settled onto the beach. Um, and we call them a set. And these clams can be really small. They're about a quarter inch or smaller when they hit the beach and then they grow about three and a half inches the first year. And so that's kind of where our breakdown is from our three and a half inches and below we call our juveniles anything over three and a half inches we're looking at as our mature clams. So these assessments give us an overall abundance. So we kind of know what our clams per square meter is on what we would consider the clam bed. So we start above where we would find clams normally and we go as far west as we can. So we basically, we hit the ocean and that's as far as we can go. And these are gonna be the areas where most of the harvest occurs. And so we do this on the entire beach and then we just run it into a formula and we can kind of figure out what not only the uh, clams per square meter is, but we can also e extrapolate that out with the total area of our beach and kind of get a generalized idea of how many you know, hundreds of thousands or millions of clams that are on the beach. And then we can break it down by size and figure out like how many of them are this size, how many of them are this size. We really break it down to what would be something that people would harvest and they would take home to what they would not. And so that's where we get our juvenile and then our mature clam.